Want to play Minecraft 7? You've played a million. Why not try Mobcraft? A mod pack specifically designed for the game. I will only play the server if there's Galactic Craft. Otherwise, I'm not bothering. I just really like the ice and fire. For defeating bosses across different biomes, different dimensions, and even different planets. With a range of new weapons and fighting styles, so many mobs you can also. Ujut! And more copper, your uncle Nick will be asking to pop a field. There's plenty for the whole thing. So stay tuned and listen to the wonderful pop of someone having saw this mod pack. Hello guys, uh, thanks for that Eric. Today I'm going to show you guys how to install the Mobcraft mod pack and then I'm going to show you how to get onto the server and then I'll also show you some uh, tips and tricks along the way to make your game more optimized and, and run quicker or look better depending on your setup. So. First, if you don't have it installed already, you're going to want to install Curse Forge. Links for all these uh, websites I'll say will be in the descriptions. So you either download for Windows or download for Mac OS, depending on what you have. Once that's installed, launch it up. First, you want to select what game you have. So, you know, if Minecraft's not on here, you're going to search it up and then select it. And then once it's recognized Minecraft's on your computer, it will open on the uh, left over here, and this is where you can add your mod packs. So you want to browse mod packs, and I and you just got to search mob craft, and we are the second one currently, slightly mob craft. You want to install that. While that's installing, I would heavily recommend increasing your heavily recommend increasing your RAM. So to do that you go into the settings, go down to Minecraft and I would drag up your RAM, you know, whatever's good. This will de uh, depend on how much RAM you've got in your computer. You don't want to fill it up using all the RAM but you want to have it a high amount if, if that's all you're doing. The default it's only two um, gigabytes and it's it's Frankly, not enough. All right, and then you just got to wait for that to install, and once that's installed, uh, we'll continue. All right, so now that that's installed, you want to click on play, and then you might need to log in. Once you've logged in, click play again. Tick that you understand the risks and then play. Now usually the first time this uh, launches on your computer it will take a bit of time. Every other time after that should take significantly less time. So we'll just let that do its thing and we'll get back when that's loaded. Alright, Minecraft has loaded. You could play some single player or can play on multiplayer now if you wanted to. Um, the server should be up, but it's going to relaunch end of this week on the 14th of uh, May. Uh, yeah, May. But I would su suggest we download Optifine first because that will increase your FPS. And if you wanted to um, and your computer could handle it, you could always download shaders at this point as well. So, close down Minecraft. You want to download Optifine. Simply download download it here. Let me do that straight away. And then once that's downloaded, you want to go back to CurseForge, right click on slightly mobcraft, click open folder, click in the mods folder, and you want to drag Optifine into that. I've already got it saved over here, so slightly modded, uh, slightly mobcraft, sorry, into mods and save Optifine into that. Then you're going to want to relaunch your game and if you want to add uh, shaders, you know, you can add any shaders, shader you prefer, but there's this one here that we used for the trailer of this video. 
um, download that same principle once it's launched. Go into your Slightly Mobcraft folder, and there'll be a second uh, folder in here called Shaders. You just install that in. Okay, you've relaunched the game. Um, it is now telling you Optifine has detected a error. That's fine. You can proceed. I haven't encountered the error. I don't think it's a big deal, but if you're you know, unhappy with having Optifine, you can always delete that. That's fine. Now you can go in, change your video settings. You might change them, you know, to more details, more animation, more, higher performance, etc., etc. Depending on how your computer is, you know, you might find that you're lagging a bit. You can change some settings down to see see how you go. Then you can get on the server. As I said, um, it will launch on May the fourteenth, uh, six thirty p.m. Australian Eastern Standard Time, so we're going to have a, have a big launch on that day. Um, if you need the whitelist, you can you can hop over on Discord and, and message the general. I think there's a Minecraft chat there. Uh, you can you know if you know me personally, you can message me that way. Uh, you can comment on this YouTube video. You know we can we can work things out to get you to get you there. So um, you know what we hope to see you on. Um, I will send a link to this server events as well because we are going to look at adding more more events further down the line depending on how many regular players we have. Alright, I hope this tutorial was um, helpful and I hopefully will see you on our server. See you. Get on Discord!